what's up guys shaz here and welcome back to dead space so you're probably noticing something different i switched my game right. we're not playing it on like hard difficulty because i felt like playing it on I'm easy doesn't right feel out. right especially on, on normal actually it didn't feel right playing on normal especially when i like have all this overpowered stuff so i'm we're playing on a new save and it's all like on hard with everything i have is no longer with me so i basically have the plasma cutter and now I get my kinesis. Problem is, um, okay. Problem is, uh, this is a, like on hard, so I'm just gonna be using the plasma cutter. I'm not using any other weapon. Maybe I'll get the contact beam, but that's it. Okay, let's just see what I have. I do not have a lot of stuff. Because the enemies take a lot of like damage in this section, so it's gonna be annoying. I don't wanna. Okay, I guess I have to. Just in case I need it, I just I just save it here. But yeah, uh, we're playing on like the hard difficult on hard now. I'm not playing on impossible. It's just hard difficulty with like a permadeath system. But we're playing on impossible uh, hard and basically in hard it's just like okay that jump scared me are you there we were attacked kendra's gone one minute she was there and I, I can't believe i lost her we can still do this okay I, captain's rig thanks game we'll i already know call. that looks like the crew barricaded the door to the emergency wing we have to blow through it to get to the morgue Get some thermite from medical storage and a shock pad from zero G therapy. Should be down the corridor. Yeah, yeah already there. Communication is useless in all this static. Okay, give me more ammo. Even the game knows that on harder difficulty, it takes more shots to kill someone. Now we're gonna fight. The lighting is still pretty good for a game that came out in like 2000. So that's that actually helps me know where you are, idiots. Wait, what's the volume on? Okay, that sounds way too high than it should be. Okay, this feels better. There's gonna be some more here. Yep. You have to like aim to shoot, so that's a bit annoying. Where's the rest of them? There we are. I finally convinced Jurgens to show me the video picture of the colony. And what I saw was glorious. Breathtaking. Miners undergoing a transformation to something extraordinary. I was no more. Even as the believer within me wants to become one of them, the scientist needs to uncover their secrets. I need to study one of these necromorphs, a kind so clinically put in. Come on! I need to witness this effect. They take so many shots now. Perhaps and hard. Patient from the colony. Where's the rest of them? Oh, there he is. Stop going into the vents! Are we done? Okay, we're done. How much ammo do, do I have? Okay, I... Wow, I lost a lot of... These guys take a lot. Like, that's a... I lost an entire pack of ammo. These guys actually don't drop anything if you like... Oh, wait, they do. Huh. 
On my first playthrough, they didn't even drop anything. Or maybe they do, and I just don't notice it. What in God's name is going on down there? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You, you know that. Well, God knows people see a bunch of psycho anyway, psychotic monsters and say it's God's work. It all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness? The transformation unitology teaches us, Doctor. Terence. Okay. There will always be risk when the stakes are high, and here, they're enormous. It could change everything. I'm still surprised That's how idiots like these are like happy with what they're doing. Okay. All right, let me just save here. So as you, as you can see, the top one is like my medium one, the one you saw, you guys saw in the first playthrough. This is the one I'm doing right now. So let me just save here. Oh yeah, oh, this is the part where you see the babies. That thing is laughing by the way. If you haven't noticed. Damn. Ammo, I'll take that. Alright, time to fight me, baby. Come here, I'll... Oh, I died. Okay, what the hell? Kick the baby! Their tendrils take so much damage, what the hell? I'm trying to hit that. Thank you. What? Hold on, oh great. My my mouse has an issue where it like, but I don't know, it just... Hold on. So annoying, I don't know why it does that. Okay, looks like my mouse is stuck on screen now. Why is it showing? What the hell? Well, we're stuck with it, I guess. Is there anything to pick up? Some ammo? Take this. Got what I need. need. Alright. That thermite you picked up should be able to melt through the barricade. Use the shock pad to ignite it. Hope I can hold this position. I can hear something big moving out there. I heard something. Come on, reload. Yeah, shooting them, them in the legs doesn't make any, like, point. The mouse is annoying me a lot. Oh, I forgot to get some stuff here. Let me just save. Okay, hold on, let me just fix this mouse issue. Alright, fix it. Uh, no, not that way. Let me just 
Let me just sell some stuff. I've got a lot of stuff on me. I need to find a bench. Because I'm gonna upgrade the hell out of the plasma cutter. So I might need some stuff. Uh, right now. I'll take one small med pack. That's it. I'm not wa wasting money on any other weapon. Because it's not worth it. Okay, we go this way now. I'm not afraid, game. Ammo. Uh. How much ammo do I have? Okay, I've got I've got lots of them now. Good. That was loud. Uh, I'm, I don't want to read. All right, what do I invest in? Probably gonna increase the damage. Okay, I don't have enough for more. Uh, what do I do for the rig? More air. I hate it. I like that they re replaced the, that system in from Dead Space one, uh, uh, remake. Now you have actually like you don't need to waste your nodes. Okay, game. I was already doing that. Kind of wish you could remove these like small tutorials. I don't need it. It's happening again. Really, game. Let me just lower the volume on my headphones. It's gonna be loud for you guys, but it's gonna be low for me. There's one in there. Always take, go for the limbs. What is this? First round, not gonna use it. Ah, wait, I said that. Go up. Already put that there. Okay. Anyone else? Save here, just in case. I don't want to risk any like, if if it, ha I don't want to risk like a death. Okay, this way. Okay, can you get me out of here, please? Money, I need that. Ammo, I also need that. Oh, 30k, that's nice. As you know, Yishimura is able to set his gravity locally. Your grab boots will kick in when you enter a zero G area. Okay, these areas. This is so annoying. This is so annoying in the like uh, in this game because it's like uh, you have to press like go to like wall to wall, but. A bug will happen if you're like playing on like a good PC like the one I'm playing on right now the game will bug out and it will apparently like kill off Isaac it will kill uh, kill Isaac if uh, like I go uh, if I like do a wrong movement or I like try to do it here what I'm trying to say is basically 
because uh, I've got a lot of like smooth frames, like a hundred plus frames, the game is gonna bug out with like how fast Isaac moves and will accidentally kill me, thinking that I'm like because the animation isn't that fast enough to render movement. Exiting zero gravity. Great. You got a shock pad. Combine that with the thermite at the barricade to destroy it. Shit. Zero I can hear gravity. more coming. Moving through the vents. Yeah. Stay safe, Isaac. I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Run! Are there more? Okay, it looks like we're good. What for? What's the extra battery for then? Let me just back up a bit. All right. Exiting zero gravity. Entering vacuum. Okay, I head back. How the hell are you here? Wait, these guys can. I don't remember them like being able to walk on anti gravity zones. Or was it? Was it always like that? I honestly can't remember if these guys were able to walk in anti-gravity -gra zones. Exiting. I like how even with like one one node of damage, I'm doing a lot good, better. Uh, let me just save. But I feel like the game's gonna screw me over soon enough by like giving me fight, making me fight a whole horde. All right. I see him. I can appreciate the fact that they actually like, let you see them and not just make it a dumb jump scare. Like you can shoot them before they get out of the vent. What? Oh. Keep running. Alright. Let, you, let me just put in some upgrades. Oh, okay, where, where's my mouse? Oh wait, okay. So this is what I was talking about. These gaps you see, they're not in the remake. They knew that it, this was the, like some of the dumbest things they added and they didn't want the players to suffer for it. Suffer for it, okay. Uh, okay, this is a good spot because now I have like, uh, I can like get anything I want. Like faster reload, more damage. I might go invest on a node or the, buy a node right now. We'll see. Oh yeah, these guys are gonna. Weapons like the flamethrower might be good for these enemies. I don't know. Maybe I should. I should get one of them. I maybe should. I should get a flamethrower. I know I'm gonna go for a contact beam. But maybe a flamethrower would work well. Okay, I just heard a pop up. I don't know why. Alright. Oh, I have to do this. And just like that, the door opened. There's a whole ass scene in the remake for this. Why do I feel like something's gonna jump out from there? Let me just get, let me just sell some stuff. Do I have anything to sell? First round, no. Uh, I'm good with that. Power nodes. Yes. I might go in, should I go back and like upgrade this weapon? Nah, I'll find one soon enough. Let me just save, bro. I need to save. Yes, I know I'm safe coming, but in a game like this, you can't take any chances. I think I just made an extra save. I have to remember okay, I made an extra one. Should be clear from there to the morgue. 
Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. This is senior medical officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds, we are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. Every quarter. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure come on. Out here somewhere. Oh, here, it's come all of them. Of course, they're all of them are going to show up now. Show me your tendrils. Okay, come on, you two. Show it. Show him. I hate these guys. There's only not actually the only but there's there's the like most annoying range enemy in the game. Let me just look around. Might find some good weapons. Oh uh, I don't need a weapon. Funny enough, you can't actually find weapons on the wall or anything like that. Like this plasma cutter in my hand, that's the only actual weapon you can like get from the game. And everything else is like to be bought from the shop. I missed. Reload, reload, reload. More of them. Yeah, Genesis is sucks in this game. Okay, that was a weird sound they made. I really need to upgrade my stasis. It's gonna be a pain uh, if I Hello? in a like bigger fight. My name is Eileen Fisk. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God, the physical guy. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Get off me. Another one. Anyone else? Okay, no, it's only these three. I feel like some of them are like coming up from behind me. Behind me, behind me. No? Okay. They still make sounds after dying which is annoying. What's my health? Okay, I still have a lot of health but the... My, I thought I, I may, may use my like big med kit. I don't know why there's an oxygen here. Yeah, this plasma cutter is in desperate need of like damage. Yeah, I'm not watching that lady. She's crazy. Now we get to fight the most annoying enemy in the game. And by annoying, I'm not joking. That thing like makes everything into a harder necromorph. So killing it is my main like purpose right now. Let me just leave that safe. What is that sound? Oh, it's probably her. Science log, Chief Science Officer Dr. Kine reporting. The colony's problems concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker. But the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Must be legal Dr. legend players. Planet Psychiatrist, 
has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. Need oh God. Yeah, I'm and gonna have to fight one top of them, one of them top. Uh, is there anything to use here? Any explosives? No? Alright, and I don't have stasis. Crap, this is gonna be a pain. Keep them there, keep them there, keep them there. Sorry, Lord. Keep shooting it. Okay, that's right. Oh, thank God I stopped that. If that thing uh, uh, got out, it would have infected everyone else. Codes received, and they look good. Thank God. I'll start accessing the captain's records right now. Nord. Head to the tram station, and I'll contact oh, you there. Yes. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship. Ammo. Those uh, like specific necromorphs are such a pain to deal with because they take a huge amount of damage. Just for like cutting off their limbs. I really need to upgrade my plasma cutter. I might put in some in I more I might put some in damage. Where are we? You're back at medical, I think. And now they become the regular enemies. Look at that! There's also a high chance they, that uh, even if you like cut two limbs, there's gonna they're still gonna be able to move. Isaac. Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread okay. to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. Huh. Well, that went well. Alright guys, I'm gonna be ending the video here. If you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.